with our team for this year, suicide prevention, um, it is changing the narrative. So being that that's the team, it's all about focusing on saying what your narrative is. And in order to change it, we have to hear, we have to be able to communicate it. So to be able to reach that point, we have to hear others be able to show um, this is what I'm going through. And then someone else will be, you know what, I'm going through that too. And by creating that bond that their thoughts and their feelings are heard and validated, and that's something that should be quiet about or shouldn't be spoken about. And, and that's one of the things that lets the, the person that's going through it lengthen the time before they get help is that they don't want to say what they're going through. So by making it something we acknowledge that someone can go through, it is more easier for someone to say, it's happening to me too. What have you done to help to make it through those moments? Um, one of the things that's very difficult is stigma. Those who do look for help, um, they're afraid of being seen as someone that is not stable. And for instance, always uh, once you hear mental or psychology, um, everyone that hears that you think, oh, what they're saying is not validated. And that's far from the truth that we want to ensure that that person is heard. It does not mean that you're crazy as a lot of people want to think. It means that you have feelings and thoughts that needs to be addressed. And the first step is talking about it. 